Hello, fire signs. My Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I want to see what's coming towards you in April. So this is a general message for all the fire signs and it's for the month of April. Remember to take what resonates because it's a general message and let's see what's coming towards you in April. Okay, roles might be reversed if I have cross watchers, but whatever I'm saying, something in it will be for you, I hope. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel if there's something in this. Okay, so there might be some illusions that you're able to see through during April. Okay, you'll, you have some addictions maybe or some negative illusory thoughts that you need to work on here. Okay, more the star. Okay, but you'll be able to heal. You've done a lot of healing and you're able to put this negative thought patterns, illusions and secrets maybe, the hidden things of your past behind you. And with strength reversed, yeah. You might be at a point in your journey where you're struggling to keep up your mental strength, okay? You might be doubting your strength. Uh, this is for my Leos especially. You're doubting your strength at the moment. But don't give up, okay? And then the Wheel of Fortune. You're going through something that's very important for your journey, for your path, okay? For your destiny. So you just have to heal, go through this, put some addictions behind you, put some secret behaviors, put something negative in your past here to find, regain your mental strength, okay? Because your destiny is happening. And when your destiny happens, you need to go with it. We have four major arcana, so this is a very, very uh, important thing happening in your life. With the Page of Pentacles, you might be studying something new, learning something new. But this is about like starting to take action on a project that you know can build your abundant future. You might have some throat chakra blockages because my throat chakra is really acting up now. Um, let's see one more card please for depth. With the Six of Pentacles in the reverse, okay. So you might be feeling like things are not balanced. There's something in your life that you're feeling like you deserve to get here. But it hasn't come in and you feel like people are being unfair to you. Not appreciating the things you give to them. Uh, you need to fight to kind of find your mental strength and keep going. You can't expect people to give you something just because you gave it to them. You have to actually just be open to receiving, okay? And with the seven of ones here, there's, it's like you've been victorious in something, but then you're starting to lose hope and lose faith in it because people are trying to break you down because they don't want you to have this victory. And with the five of swords, someone really hurt you, okay? Someone really hurt you here. Let's just get some clarification from the Morgan Greer Tarot and then I'll do some runes and some oracle messages for you. So clarification please for the fire signs. There's a lot of major arcanas here. So this is a very important time for you. Please guys, if this is resonating, like, share and subscribe or interact with the video. Well, we have... The Six of Pentacles again, it's the same card, but this time it's upright, okay? So it's going, you're going to get what you deserve. You're going to get balance. You're going to get, you're going to feel like you're getting payback for everyone you helped, okay? You just need to get through this rough patch here. You're going, it's going to balance out. It just feels rough at the moment, but it's going to balance out, okay? You just have to keep going, not give up. Not let these people who's not wanting you to have your victory, do not let them break you down, okay? Four of Cups, yeah, there's something you're not seeing here. There's an offer, an opportunity for growth, for feelings, for spiritual growth that's being offered to you, but you're not seeing it at the moment. You're focusing too much on no, 
what you know you already have in your life. You need to open your eyes, go into nature and open up for your spirit guides to send you messages here, okay? You're too focused on the hurt in your past. You need to get through it and heal it. Put your addictions aside, okay? There might be a masculine energy, a man or just a very masculine energy who's been affecting you. Well, we have the Ten of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. So for some of you, someone wants to marry you. For others of you, someone wants to offer you a partnership that can really be abundant for you. But these two together, to me, talk about marriage. So there is a possibility for you to build a stable foundation and a solid partnership with someone here. But this might also be someone wanting to celebrate your success and build like a business with you, okay? So it's different for all of you. And again with the victory. So you're going to be victorious in this. You just have to keep going. You're going to be recognized for someone, something. Someone wants to come in and offer you something, okay? But you're, there's a lot of illusions happening. This might be happening around the full moon, the 6th of April as well. But something unexpected is happening. Let's do some runes. So we have the rune of man and feelings. Okay. This is about you connecting to your spirituality more, getting more messages from the divine. Um, you might have a role where you're helping people understand their connection to the divine and man's place in this world. Okay. This might also be a masculine energy, a man coming in to offer you feelings and emotions and help you with your spiritual growth. So for a group of you, this is you elevating to a place where you can help people as a spiritual leader, spiritual teacher. For others of you, this is a man wanting to come in and give you romantic, a romantic offer. Okay, so let's see what the oracle cards have to say about this. This is this messages from the spirits of nature oracle deck let's see we have sage purification so it's a need for you to cleanse your energy you need to do some cleanse spiritual cleanses you don't have to use sage but do some spiritual cleanses cleanse off the bad energy from your past this is also about you seeing how much cleansing and purging of negative energies you've already done being proud of that see how far you came okay be proud of all the cleansing all the growth you've had all the transmuting of negative energies into positiveness be proud of it and don't give up okay don't give up so one more oracle cards please for my fire signs air ruach yeah this is about um something you're not seeing okay something you're not seeing that feels heavy there's something you're not seeing clearly at the moment you need to like find the balance to see what's happening okay one more please for the fire signs please it's a bit slow going there you go and we have eagle wish yeah you're expanding your vision you're expanding your third eye you're uh, expanding your knowledge of the world and getting an overview for the rest of your spiritual journey so just give yourself time to heal to work through the stagnant energy to be proud of the growth you've seen in your life how far you came okay be proud work through it you have so much good energy and abundance coming into your life. It might be that you've been dealing with depression or anxiety and sleepless nights and kind of regressing into a bad energy lately, uh, feeling a lot of negative hurts from your past resurfacing. This is happening for you to, to transform the energy so you can really take the next step in your spiritual journey to your inner self and to connecting with your guides, okay? There's things you're healing. You're getting an overview of yourself, your soul's paths and your journey here. Rain renewal, yeah, you're cleansing. You're cleansing off negative energies. Someone is going to come in and offer you an opportunity, either in love or in business. Uh, maybe even offer you financial support. 
maybe because they're seeing your growth they're seeing how strong you are everything you got through and they don't want you to fall into this depression again so just be prepared for that i love you fire signs i hope this is resonating if it did resonate please give me a like share the video if you think it will resonate for another fire sign and then also please give me some feedback because i would love to keep doing this okay i love you i love you fire signs hope you have an amazing april